So I've come down to the beach for a little seed bass hunt and I thought I'd take you along with me. Starting next week, I'm going to start posting a series of videos on creating a sea glass mosaic lighthouse. And I'm going to present it in a workshop manner. More to come on that. But today I'm coming to see if I can collect some materials for my next sea glass mosaic. So come along with me for a nice sea glass hunt. There is a piece of white pottery and I got this gray stone with some white on it. Those are both kind of cool. And there is a little awkward piece, a couple of round pieces. There's a beauty of a piece, really nice green piece. I don't very often see the bald eagle hanging out of the beach. Oh, there he goes. I've been watching him trying to get closer. Now he's flying away. So I don't find a whole lot of blue, and today I found two tiny little blue pieces. That's awesome. Put those two pieces together, they almost look like the wings of a bird. And along this beach, we do not find many multicolored pieces of sea glass. And today I found three of them. I can't believe it. So this one here is a white piece that has some blue on it. The blue is actually in the piece of white sea glass. And here's another white piece that has some orange on it. I never find orange. And this one is fairly well done. That's very cool little rough. And then this piece, it's not very well done at all, but it's like a pale blue piece of sea glass with red painting on it that hasn't worn off. Super cool. Pretty cool finds for today. So you could go for one beach walk or you could go for five. It took me five beach walks to get all of these beach treasures and pieces of sea glass. I think I've done pretty good for five different beach walks. I went down between changes in the tide. So each tide that when the tide goes out, it comes back in, brings a bit more sea glass with it. There's also, the weather's been really beautiful here this week. So I've had quite a bit of competition for the sea glass hunt. So I think I've done pretty good to get a nice little collection. Now this is not enough to make a mosaic, but it's a pretty good haul and it's going to contribute some to my sea glass mosaic. So join me next time and I'll show you what I'm going to do with some of this sea glass. Did you see that? Yeah, I hear it. Rocks are falling. I know, I got that. <laughs>